Most of us probably have not sat in the back rooms of politics, the places where decisions are actually made. But today's guest on the Govern Yourself Accordingly podcast has, and he's done the rest of us a favor, especially those of us who try to have an impact on the decisions being made in our communities, states, provinces, and countries. Graham Steele is the former finance minister for the Canadian province of Nova Scotia. In his new book, The Effective Citizen, he has drawn a roadmap of the politician's brain. He's codified the thought patterns, behaviors, and patterns of speech that even the best of our politicians use as crutches. He's done this so that we as citizens can understand them. Beyond that, he's taken it a step further and mapped out how citizens can use that information to be more effective at advocacy and to influence policy change. He explores the big picture, how patient and persistent advocacy can have a major impact, but he also talks about the granular, like how to follow up on a meeting with a decision maker so they're more likely to do what they told you they'd do and the most productive relationships between citizens and politicians are those where these things can be said out loud. To sit down at a table with a politician as an equal, and it starts with sitting down with a politician. Graham Steele was in politics for 15 years, three as a political staffer, 12 as an elected official, and three of those were as finance minister. Before politics, he was a Rhodes Scholarship recipient and worked for a decade as a lawyer. He now teaches business law at Dahazi University in Halifax. My first book was called What I Learned About Politics, and and what I wanted to do in that book.